Today for writing, we are going to be working on sequencing. And sequencing just means putting the events in a story in the order that they happened. So putting them in time order. So like your day in time order, the sequence of your day is you wake up, you eat breakfast, you do your schoolwork, you eat lunch. Those things happen in time order. And we are going to be using some transition words. And transition words um, show how events took place over time. And we're going to use three specific transition words. We're going to use the words first to show what happened first. Next to show that this is what happened after the first thing. And then we're going to use the transition word last to show what happened last in a story. Now, as an example, I have the different stages of eating an apple, right? So first, I would say, I get an, oops, I'm sorry, I did not write that. First, I get an apple from the fridge, all right? So... First, I get an apple from the fridge. There's my nice red apple. Next. So now I'm going to use that word next. I'm going to type that in. Next, I take bites out of the apple. All right. And last. Last. Now I'm going to use that word last. And I'm putting a comma after it because after each transition word, especially if you're using that word in the, as the first word in the sentence, you need that comma, that little mark right there. So last, I throw away the apple core. So I am sequencing the stage, uh, what happens in time order of eating an apple. First, I get an apple from the fridge. Next, I take bites out of the apple. And last, I throw away the apple core. So I've used sequencing. I went from what happened at the beginning to what happened at the end. And I've used transition words like first, next, and last. Now I want you to do the same thing in your assignment, only this time I'm going to have you talk to me about what happens um, when a plant grows. So you will sequence what happened first, next, and last in plant growth. And there's no certain answer that I'm looking for. I'm just looking for you to use the words first, next, and last as transition words in sequencing an event.